One other option from the clinch, and we're gonna film all these, they'll be available in the app and kind of more detailed instructionals. Um, but here, just a basic hip throw, right? So if I'm here, I'm gonna step inside of Tim's feet and I'm gonna push my hip up and get him up off the ground. You probably worked this in the fundamentals class. I do like the option from here. I know it's a little bit difficult with the gun belt, but I've seen it done at work. One of my partners really likes to do this. Um, I've watched him do it a few times with a full gun belt. It doesn't necessarily matter. Maybe something you get caught up, but when you're doing this dynamically, I think you'll find that- It's also fast, so yeah, less, less. It, it's pretty quick. I don't think, the gun isn't, belt doesn't necessarily- isn't, isn't, there's, a, there's a video somewhere, I, I don't know where, I think it's, I can't, it's like in Asia somewhere, where a guy comes out with a dude with a machete, like this, and he, he does this. He literally blocks, grabs, and tosses. Yeah. Not the same too. It's, really, yeah. it's actually good. But it's fast. It's not slow. Yep, you do it quick. So we're in here. Again, I'm going to step my foot. Step one, step two. Get Tim up. And then all I'm doing is I'm going to turn and look in the direction that I want to go. So I'm here. Turn. I'm not trying to power through this and like throw Tim across the room. It's really just all about um, leverage and making sure I'm getting him up off the ground. And all I'm doing with my feet is stepping in between his feet and pushing my hip out. Those details make all the difference. I think when we first teach this to like newer white belts or people that have never done this before. Yeah, they stand wide. Yeah, they, <laughs> they stand really wide. Yeah. Or they do, they're like this. And they, yeah, they don't really know what to do with their hips. And if you notice, like if I, if I step really wide, I, I have a lot less mobility in my hips and I can't get them out far enough to get Tim up off the ground versus if I'm narrow, well now I can really push my hip up and all I gotta do to get him up off the ground is extend my butt. Um, it just makes it a lot easier. So something to think about.